Hey guys, so we have an awesome test here between the best LG and the best Samsung. So let's go right to it. Now these two phones are the best specs on the market. They're the first two with the latest Snapdragon. And they also have massive batteries. So in terms of the first test, boot up. We have a Vanger for the LG. And now the Samsung's up. All right guys, now for the specs. The Samsung screen's a high resolution. And also a fast refresh rate. Now on the front, the Samsung has a high resolution camera. And on the back, we have three cameras versus four. The Samsung has large options for storage, but both support micro SD. Both phones have massive batteries. And both have the same chipset, but the Samsung has double the RAM. Both phones are water resistant. Now at the bottom, both phones are Type-C. And believe it or not, you have a headphone jack on the LG. Both phones are wireless charging. And on the back, both are glass. The Samsung costs more money. Alright guys, let's get to it. Alright guys, get into it. Reddit. Pretty close there. eBay. Samsung. Spotify. Again, pretty close. YouTube. Samsung. Instagram. Very close there. Now, both have the way to Snapdragon. But keep in mind, the Samsung is double the RAM. Amazon shopping. Very close. And last space of gap, we have photos. All right guys, so now for gaming. So first up we have PUBG. So I think for gaming the RAM should be more significant. Yeah, so Samsung wins for PUBG. Then for Unto. Slight advantage here for the Samsung. Plans for Zombies. Very slight advantage for the Samsung. And now for the big one, we have Fortnite. So, so far, a uh, nice advantage here for the Samsung. So, Samsung's the first at the play. But the LG is about a second behind there. Alright, so let's fast forward.
And we have Vans here for the Samsung. Now for Geekbench. And run this in a few. Next we have Chrome. And it's in a quick web history. All right, so first up, IGN.com, Samsung, INDB.com, again, slight advantage here for the Samsung, LG.com, Samsung. And last one we have Samsung. Samsung.com. Yep, so overall Vane is here for the Samsung. Vine, hi, no copyright. And now for the speakers. Now both phones have dual speakers. So first you have the LG. Samsung. Back to LG. Last time here. Now both get pretty loud. But I do prefer the quality a bit for the LG. Now for the fingerprints. Alright, so a bit quicker here for the Samsung overall. Yeah, this is a longer animation for the LG. Time now for battery. So check back in a few. All right, so four hours in, let's go and check in. Okay, so the answer for the LG.
Time out for Ram. So, going back to the start here. Both hoarded. eBay. Excellent. Spotify. Now both are doing a great job here. So let's load up the camera app to make it a bit tougher. Now going back to YouTube. Okay, so once we add on the camera app, then the LG starts to refresh. Instagram. Yeah, refresh there for Instagram. Amazon Shopping. That one holds. PUBG. Great job here. Fortnite. Excellent. Temp run. Perfect. And now for Geekbench. So I had to be answer for the Samsung. Next you have the camera speed. All right, so first we'll do the default cameras for them. Default resolution. So a bit quicker for the LG. And now we're gonna change it. So we're gonna change it to 64, uh, 64 MP for the LG. And 108 MP for the Samsung. Yeah, so still advanced here for the LG. All right, so now for the camera test. Now, currently I'm not going outside being in New York City. So unfortunately I can't film this stuff outside, but I did ask you guys on Twitter, uh, which was your preference? So the one that you went with is the film indoors. So for the zoom test, the Galaxy is 100x for the photo mode, but first I'm gonna show you guys 10x for each because that's the max for the LG. At 10x, the Galaxy definitely looks a bit better, but when we zoom into 100x, it gets pretty ugly. <laughs> so it's honestly not even worth doing 100x for the Samsung, but between 10 and 30 range is pretty solid. Now for the fun cameras. And the stabilization. All right, so now for the rear cameras. So this is where I film the videos. Uh, you guys see we have the tripod and we have a uh, Google Home back there. So let's switch over to the wide angle. There's look at the wide angle on each. And we'll also do the maximum zoom. So here's the maximum zoom, which is 10x for the LG and 20x for the Samsung. We also have a look at the live video mode for the Samsung. So this pours out the background uh, using the fourth camera. All 
All right, guys, so let me know in the comments below which one won. Now, overall, pretty close results, but the LG is less expensive. As always, thanks for watching, subscribe for more, and stay safe.